Hey guys, what's up? It's Andre Salazar. We're here uh, in the studio in Ventura, California. This is the Art of Comics. And today, we're kind of subdued. I don't know why. We're going to talk about Trinity. We're going to talk about the Trinity. But unlike uh, Sunday School, where it's Father, the Son, and Holy Ghost, it's Superman, Batman, and Wonder Woman. And it is <laughs> slightly sacrilegious, perhaps. I don't know. Um, I got this book by Eagle Moss Collections. Eagle Moss is European, I think British. They bind and republish DC, I think Marvel books too, in Europe. And they got a hold of this collection of uh, issues by Matt Wagner called Trinity by DC Comics. And so I got this in one of those boxes for like 25 bucks. You got all these hardcovers. So uh, it's, kinda, it's nice. It's a fine production. Whatever. Uh, but it's cheap, so that's what I'm all about. And I bought it, and I like Matt Wagner. I remember reading him back in the day with Grindel. So Grindel, red, white, and white, red, and black, or black, black, white, and red, something like that. It's black, white, and red. Uh, Grindel 1000 or something like that. Um, all that stuff. Grindel, Hunter Rose, all that jazz. So I've known of his work since the, the back in the day when he was indie. Uh, I never read Mage, although I know a lot of people like Mage. I do like his work. I met him. We did a book signing next to each other for a day, and that was a lot of fun getting to know him and his family and his daughter and such. Talked about our kids. Um, really nice guy. Seems like a sweet dude. And his son, I think he's getting his son into like coloring for him and things like that. So he's working. And what I, one of the things I liked about this book was the art, of course. I mean, we kind of talk a lot about the art in this channel. Um, there is a, I don't, do you guys get a Frank Miller vibe from this at all? The art, the, the way things are kind of broken down in a simplified way with the line work, the hands things like that. It reminds me, the ink work and the hands remind me of Miller, Frank Miller stuff. It also reminds me of Toth. Uh, some of the shadows, positions, the, the panel uh, compositions, not page composition, but more of the panel compositions and things like that remind me a little bit of Toth. So I like that. I like Alex Toth a lot. And I like Miller a lot. And it's and it's kind of like simple down. Not a lot of extra hatching or rendering. It just breaks it down into nice clean shapes. Coloring is well done. This is kind of like a retro story of... Well, it's the first time Wonder Woman is on the scene. So Batman and Robin... Excuse me. Batman and Superman have worked together before. But this is the first time I think Wonder Woman's coming in on in the scene on this this era, and the three of them are working together to try to uncover uh, these missiles, this kind of uh, terrorist plot that Ra's al Ghul. By the way, is it Ra's al Ghul or is it Ra's al Ghul? I always have pronunciated it Ra's, Ra's al Ghul, but over the last 20, 15 years, I've heard it's supposed to be. Raish Agul. You tell me in the comments. I don't know how you're going to figure that out, but somehow type it. Raz Agul or Raish Agul? Anyway, good old Raz is causing hell, and he's like an environmentalist, environmental terrorist. He's got these nuclear bombs, and he's going to blow us all back into the Stone Age, and then the world will be a paradise again, and we won't be polluting things. Don't really know how that works. Because, well, you do have something called fallout and freaking radiation poisoning. So I don't really know how it's going to turn into a paradisical Eden when um, everything's freaking bombed out. But that's his plan. So the, our trio have to go and they kind of uncover where the base is. And they go to where Wonder Woman's from, that little Amazonian island called... Ther Therosia or something like what is that pronunciated it called? It's paradise. I don't remember what it's called. You guys know it. You you superhero super nerds. 
Uh, I say that with freaking love because I'm a nerd. You guys know the name of it. But anyway, uh, they, they go to Paradise Island. It's got a name. And they kick some ass. And then Ra's al Ghul's like, okay, I'm going to go to Paradise Island and go just murder stuff. And that's a pretty cool idea. And Bizarro's in here, which is kind of cool too. So you got Bizarro in here and Raish or Ra's. <laughs> uh, very cool. I liked it. It was fine. I don't need to keep it. I don't, I don't need to buy this and own this and like read this to be more and more. I've read it once. I'm good. I don't need to give it to someone to borrow. Like, hey man, you got to read this. No, I'll do that for Blankets or Jimmy Corrigan. I won't give them this to read. Um, but the art was good. Story was fine. It's a superhero story. And so um, it, you know, it didn't suck me in all the way like I wanted to, but it's fun. So there you go. That's my, that's my, my tribute. Um, thank you for watching. I appreciate you guys. Check out my Patreon. I have a Patreon, actually, believe it or not. And I do comics. Yeah, it's true. And there's stuff there that you can't see anywhere else. So check that out. Check out some public stuff. There's even stuff you don't have to pay for. It's not like everything's costy. I give you I give you a couple free stuff, so check that out. Subscribe to the channel; it's always nice. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Every Tuesday and every Saturday, I do new videos. Sometimes I'll sprinkle in a Thursday, or I'll do a little like short thing. But uh, that's that's the plan here. Thanks for watching. Have a good one. Matane. <laughs>